What's up, Scorpio? It's me, 1028 Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. What's up, Scorpios? What's going on with you? All right? Okay, public service announcements. Announcements. Okay, I'll be doing a lot of videos, so my tongues be all twisted and tied. If you want a personal reading with me, all of that will be in the description box below. Please do not DM me and ask me if you can get a personal free reading because I'm going to say, hey, oh, no. Nah. Okay. I do give out free readings. Okay. Because everybody likes some free shit. I do give out free readings. If you follow me on Instagram and turn on your notifications, I go live and I do give out free readings. Okay. I give out free readings. I give out Chanel. It just be kind of crazy. Okay. It just all depends on how I feel that day. All right. Now, also, my thumbnail is my fashion company. Follow me on Couture Love, okay? Like up all my shit, heart it up, okay? Even if you don't buy shit, you can like the shit, okay? And also, guys, thank you for the love and support, the likes and the shares, bruh, okay? Nigga can't be on top if you can't help me, you know what I'm saying? So thank you, guys. I love you, Scorpios. All right, I am a Scorpio myself, and any videos that y'all want me to do, just tell me in the description box below or where the comments are, and I'll bust them down, okay? One, one, one on the clock, it ain't shit. You just gotta ask, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, y'all, I am going to start uh, this reading, okay? I love you guys so much. If you really like my channel, then you'll love my podcast. Check it out. It's 1028 Awakenings, and it is on Apple and Spotify. So just check my shit out, you know what I'm saying? And I, I raise to a higher level where you can comment. So, excuse me, communicate. All right, now without further ado, because I'm a Scorpio too, bitch, I'm going to start a goddamn video. You know what I'm saying? You be like, bitch, shut up, okay? All right, so what's up, y'all? Hey, my Scorpios, I love you because I'm a Scorpio too, bitch. And you know, we love our motherfucking selves, okay? All right, so I'm going to pull this down so that you guys can see the cards. All right, normally I start off all my readings with angel numbers, but not today, nigga. Not today. All right, we're going straight to the T. Okay, so Scorpios, let's see what the fuck going on. Okay, we about to see what the scoop is, what's crowning this read, and where we going. All right, where the fuck we going with this shit, Okay. Scorpios. Okay, so damn, it ain't really come out, but it was a pre-shuffle. So somebody is emerging in their motherfucking feelings about your ass, or you're drowning in your feelings about somebody else's motherfucking ass. Either way it goes, somebody drowning. All right, crowning the reef, finally. Oh, relax, relax. Hey, this weed was made for you. All right, so somebody just kicking the shit. Somebody just trying to clear their motherfucking mind, Scorpio. Okay, they could be hitting a blunt. Okay, damn, Spirit said take them to the Kipper deck. Okay, so you you know somebody is chilling. They trying to get their mind right. Okay, they smoking a spliff. Okay, they doing their thing. All right, they trying to relax. They clearing their mind, Scorpio. This could be your energy or it could be the person that you're thinking about. Damn, the lover's car is trying to come out. Okay, damn, Scorpio, you got a nigga stressed over you like that. They got to hit the blunt. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. All right. So somebody is clearing their mind. They trying to relax. They trying to hit the blunt. Okay. Ooh, because they don't want to be in this marriage no more. Ooh, damn, Scorpio. So Scorpio, you could be married or somebody could be thinking about how they want to end some shit because they want to be with your motherfucking ass either way it go. I get high, 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 high. Okay, so somebody just chilling and relaxing and thinking about how they just want to end their marriage because they want to move towards you. Okay, so damn, Scorpio, right out the gate, y'all ain't holding nothing. All right, so let's see what the hidden truth is behind this motherfucker. Okay, because either this is you and you realize this nigga is a cheating ass, lying ass, sorry ass nigga. And now you just like, you know what? I'm finna hit the blunt and file these motherfucking papers. Or somebody is thinking about you and they like, you know, three is a crowd. I gotta get this bitch gone so I can fucking vibe with my motherfucking Scorpio. Okay, all right, right out the gate. Here we go. We'll hit. Okay, I can't stop thinking. Every time I try to leave, something keeps pulling me back, me back, telling me I need you in my life. So somebody is like, damn. I can't stop thinking about Scorpio. You on my mind. I don't think about my wife. I don't think about my husband. All I do is get high, 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 high. All right? So they trying to clear their mind. You know, they trying to get this shit right. They trying to figure out what the fuck going on because you on their mind. Okay? All right. So 
Damn, so this person lied to your ass. Look, I regret lying to you. Why you gotta lie, nigga? Why you gotta lie, nigga? Okay, how you gonna win when you ain't right with them, okay? So this person is regretting lying to you. They can't stop thinking about you. They did you wrong. They like, damn, that shit was fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I feel like Scorpio, you knew and you played it like a G. You like, I'm okay. I'm unbothered. It ain't no pressure, okay? But you are trying to clear your mind. That's why you keep smoking all that goddamn weed, bitch. Real talk, okay? So look, Scorpio, whatever happened between you and this person who is married or whatever happened between you and your husband or whatever happens between you and your wife, um, you don't be replaying that conversation over and over. But that bitch that you want, where it could be this Scorpio or whoever this is that's on the side that you can't think about, they replay the last time they was with you. They replay everything you fucking said. And they like, damn, bruh. Why the fuck did I lie to him? Damn. Okay. Damn. Okay, so Scorpio, let's just get to the beat. If this person does come back into your life, if this person does file for a divorce, if this person does walk away from this situation, what the fuck they coming to bring you, okay? So look, if this person is gone, just know that this was divine protection, energy at the bottom of the deck, okay? Spirit, I need some pull. I need to pull on this uh, relax and clear your mind, okay? On this person, all right? Who Who is this? What's coming What's coming to this person? That, okay, the past is motherfucking returning, bitch, okay? They thinking about making a grand entrance, okay? So look, for the bitch that's relaxing, smoking the, bleed, the weed or the... Oh, look at this shit. It's your... Look at this shit. Look at this shit. <laughs> okay, bottom of the deck. So if this person was gone, it was because they were you were being protected by your angels, okay? Just know the past is now returning. And this is happening because you relaxed, okay? You didn't put no pressure on this thing. You didn't put no pressure on this bitch. And now this person has evolved and they have now turned into the divine masculine, okay? Now, for some of you guys, you're like, what the fuck is a divine masculine? This is somebody who knows, okay, first of all, for you to even become the divine masculine or divine feminine, you have to undergo a series of fucking events that are horrible, traumatic, awful. I mean, the worst of it all, okay? All for you to get the Ten of Cups, which is open for love, unconditional love, you know, the love that you want from Jesus aka Deontay you know what I'm saying all right now some of y'all don't know what I'm saying but Jesus is Deontay and if you don't follow me on um, goddamn IG so I can break that down for you all right so the past is now returning to you all right they can't stop thinking thinking about you they regret lying to you and they replay that situation over and over again now I want to break this down you see open for love then came out two times and come to me spells y'all both thinking about each other which causes what a, a tower to come and a colliding of both worlds okay let's pull on this shit damn marriage okay so this marriage is coming to an end because whoever this person was a false person, they were like, oh, I'm your twin flame. This is your end all be all. We're going to be together forever. But look, this was a goddamn lie. It was in reverse, just like these bitches. All this shit was false. This was not your end all be all. This was your karmic. And this person fell in love with their karmic. I mean, it's okay. Shit. Maybe the pussy was good. Maybe the dick was bomb. But now... This person is open for love. This is the third fucking time. They want to rewrite the love story, okay? Look at this shit. All these cards match, all right? So somebody that's in a marriage don't want to be there anymore. They're smoking a lot of fucking weed. They're thinking about the goddamn past, okay? And they're thinking about how the past is not abusive, okay? They're thinking about how they don't argue with this motherfucker. And they're also thinking about how this person wanted to be with them. And I look, it looked like that person said, hell no, nah. hell to no. Nah, nah. Let me see. This person wanted to be with them and they told them no. Ooh, spirit said, bitch, it's complicated. It wasn't a no, but this person was married. So how the fuck you gonna be with somebody that's married? I know that's the goddamn truth. So spirit said, it was complicated, bitch. Damn, that's a post on Instagram. Are, are you in a relationship or is it complicated? All right, so it was complicated. So Spirit is saying we can't tell you a clear yes or no. Okay, all we can tell you is that they didn't invest in you and now the past is returning because they realize whoever they invested with is not their motherfucking twin flame. So I don't know why all of a sudden they want us to pull on these numbers. Damn, that was quick. Okay, so this person is trying to become brave. That's why Spirit is saying that. They <coughs> Oh shit, this person didn't tell you the truth. I'm joking. <coughs> so this person didn't speak their truth. The breath out of my mouth was taken away from me. So this person held back a lot of emotions. They held back a lot of truths from you. Okay, and now they about to try to be brave. Okay, but don't hold your breath, bro, because I almost choked. This person is having a hard time coming over here telling you the truth. And I got to be real with you, okay? Okay, because I, I choked, y'all, for real, okay? So this person is trying their best to be brave to come towards you to tell you what, okay? Damn. 
Look at this. I can't reach out. That shit is in reverse. So they about to make a move. They about to be brave and they about to motherfucking reach out. They about to talk to you. So let's see what the fuck they finna say. What you finna come tell me? Let me find out. I want to know. All right. So look, I can't reach out in reverse. This nigga coming. They about to be brave. What the fuck they finna say, Scorpio? Let's see. Damn, that's a lot of shit. This nigga had a lot of shit to say. Okay, so this person is saying, look, I work too much. Now I want to invest in you. I don't want to work like how I used to work. They also want to tell you, look, new love is out here. They're saying, hey, I'm a, a new love or a recommitment of love is developing. They're like, hey, I want to see if, you know, we can do this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Then I can kick it with you on those days. You know, they want to work less, okay? This person had past interferences, so there was an external party that was interrupting y'all relationship, okay? And they thinking about that external party, too, okay? So, they're going to come in and talk to you about their bitch. They're going to come in and talk to you about their husband, okay? They're about to tell you the tea, okay? They're about to tell you why they've been so unavailable, okay? This person... <clears throat> feels like you deserve more so they don't even want to half-ass you you know what i'm saying i feel like this is a man who has integrity i ain't even gonna lie to you because they ain't offer you shit because they was already married to somebody else and then they went back trying to make that bitch the bitch or that nigga the nigga and then that shit didn't even work so now they're trying to be brave they're trying to reach out to you they're trying to put you first they're trying to put the computer away they're trying to be available because they weren't in the past okay a lot of cards came out but we're gonna take all of them okay now, this person work a lot, okay? And when they with you, it's it's bliss. They like to kick it. Maybe y'all both smoke weed together. Shit, I don't know. But they need to find more time to goof off. This person just basically just lives for other people. Now, this person money is good. It's good as fuck, okay? Like, this person don't have no financial ch financial challenges, okay? And they think about how they want to give to you. They're also going to come to you and talk to you about how they want to balance this shit out because one person was giving too much into the marriage, you know what I'm saying? So he like, I don't want to get used, but I know I love you. Now, this nigga is obsessed with you, okay? This, this bitch is obsessed with you. All right, someone in this connection is engulfed in their thoughts, okay? So they're really obsessed with you. They really want to be with you, all right? They really feel like you are spiritual, and they want to talk about all the things they've learned from you because spiritually, this person has really ascended, okay? Now, I don't know how the fuck y'all did this, okay, but they have definitely learned a lot of spiritual lessons here and they want to talk to you about it now this person want to dig you down all right but it's not like they only want sex but boy i don't know maybe you look really good maybe you look like the queen of wands or something you know what i'm saying but they thought that this connection was only sexual okay so you're very attractive you're very handsome and they were like man i just want to cheat on my wife or i want to cheat on my husband because i just want to fuck this bitch but now they realize this is a totally different kind of obsession they cannot get you off their mind they think about you all the goddamn time last card they want to talk about how they're going to overcome obstacles with you okay they want to talk about how they had to heal a lot of wounds in order to come over here and bring you something solid okay all right damn nigga damn that's a lot of shit. This nigga didn't tell you shit, okay? Because that's a lot of shit. It was a lot of cards, all right? All right, so what's to come? If they do come back, what is to come, all right? So they about to choose love. Before they didn't choose love, they were very diplomatic. They chose, like, what they were supposed to. Shit, they wife or they husband. Like, y'all shout out with that. Y'all can't be coming out here, okay? But they choosing love because they realized who they were married to. They had a lot of differences. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. This nigga got spiritual as fuck on your ass, all right? So it looked like you may have teached this person something, and now they're choosing love. They're realizing that the person that they invested with, they on different fucking pages. Now, I strongly feel like they felt like y'all was on different pages, but that's just because they invested in the energy that was toxic as fuck. It looked like for them to be like, you not abusive, that motherfucker that they was fucking with was abusive because you, if you ain't getting your ass beat, you ain't gonna be like, well, he ain't beat my ass. Oh, so you be getting your ass beat. So that's what I'm saying. If this is a man or a woman, somebody is being disrespected. All right. So let's see. Message from spirit. That's what we gonna kick this off on. All right. Last message from Spirit came out quick. It says, be careful with self-sabotage. All right, Scorpio, see y'all next time. Bye.